Hello, my name is Tim Richards. I'm going to continue to show you some really basic blues piano techniques as featured in my book, Improvising Blues Piano, published by Shot Music. This fifth clip focuses on a left hand style called the left hand shuffle. Let's go. So once you've mastered the barrel house left hand, you can upgrade it to the left hand shuffle. Same notes, but eight to the bar. This one can be as bouncy as you like. In fact, there's a piece in the book called Bouncy Boogie. Like that in the key of D. Before we look at any individual pieces, I'm going to suggest that you master some on-off and off-on chord rhythms. Now, with the barrel house, these are quite easy. Here's an on-off rhythm. beat, second chord off the beat on the two and, that'll be in between the left hand. Now when you're playing eight to the bar, that off the beat chord will be with the second of the pair of quavers. So you need to master that around the 12 bar sequence until you're absolutely comfortable with the coordination including all the chord changes. The left hand shuffle itself is just the simplest version of a whole family of left hand styles called the rocks. They all use double notes based around the root and fifth but they involve sometimes a sixth and the blue third as well. The simplest example in the book is on off boogie in straight eights. I think it's really important to sort the coordination of these rhythms out with on-off chords in the right hand before you try anything more adventurous. So on-off boogie, try the on-off chords in every bar before you go any further. Another example uses this left hand. And I'm going to play a different type of on off chord in which the second chord is on the three hand rather than the two hand. That's a bit later than the last example. Blues with Pickups, page 66, demonstrates combining on-off chords with some thirds ideas in the key of G with a left hand shuffle. Mm -hmm. 